Well, I have to tell you, the bombs and rockets exploding in the Middle East, they are reverberating right here on Manhattan's east side in the form of this explosive demonstration. It began at 5 o'clock. Take a look. The crowd is still here. I think this is right across from the PIX headquarters, our PIX studios. If we have our rooftop camera, you can get a better perspective of seeing the size of this crowd. My guessing, covering these, we've got as many as 1,000 people out here, and they are quite vocal. There have been a couple of fisticuffs, some confrontations. One police source told me there's been at least one arrest. Otherwise, loud, but generally peaceful. They are waving their Palestinian flag. This is a rally called Emergency Rally for Palestine, and it says, Defend Jerusalem, Gaza under attack. And some of the signs here, we have uh, one sign I saw, Jews for Palestinian Liberation. I spoke to a woman, and she said she does support the Palestinian effort, but she would not talk to me on camera. Others are saying, end the occupation, free Palestine now, no more money for Israeli crime. Now, all of this is in the aftermath of days of protests getting violent in the past couple of days, hundreds of casualties from the bombs and the rockets being heaved by both sides, started with Hamas heaving rockets into Israel and claiming that the Palestinian people are beating, being treated unjustly, and of course, Israel retaliated. I saw one video before, kind of uh, frightening hearing the sirens wailing inside Tel Aviv. Uh, Benjamin Netanyahu, the prime minister, has said he had vowed to continue defending his state of Israel. This is not yet over, and we're hearing the voices of people here who are protesting here right across from the Israeli consulate and in front of PIC Studios. We'll have more on this for you on the PIX11 News at 10. For now, Marvin Scott, PIX11 News.